Hey guys, today we're going to take a look at the lower level of the Grand Central Terminal. Now we've already had a look at the upper level. Uh, I'm not going to do too much talking today. We're just going to head down to the lower level. Uh, part of the reason I'm not going to talk too much is because normally it's as loud as can be down there. So what we're going to do is we go down the slope here where you see it says the dining concourse. And other than one little item, I'm not going to say too much. I'll just tell you about the first item when we get down there. Now the first item is somewhat popular. Although I say that, probably there's going to be nobody there. And this is called the Whispering Corner. Now you may have heard about this. And it's actually right here. So this little alcove at the bottom of the uh, slope, this is the Whispering Corner. What you do, one person stands in this corner, and another person stands in that corner, and they whisper into the corner, and they can hear each other. The same goes for that corner right there. That one pairs with this corner. People come up, and all they have to do is whisper in there, and the sound travels all the way around. Now, I've tried this, and it actually worked. In fact, there's two people trying it right now. <laughs> Was you able to hear each other? Good. It yeah, works, yeah. right? Yeah. You should, you should go in the corner. I'll talk to you. Yeah, no, I've already done it. I was yeah, just telling everyone. It's so yeah. Cool. I love telling it. It is brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. Take care, boss. So somebody just tried it, and there you go. They said it works. So I'm hoping uh, may, maybe I should uh, grab a couple of people here and uh, get them to try it. But anyway. This is mainly the uh, food court down here. The, another um, part that you need to know, again, if you're in the vicinity, if you're in the vicinity, nobody puts baby in the corner. This is another place where you'd be able to come and use the bathroom. Now, I'm not sure where they are, but they are here on the lower level. Maybe if we walk around back there, they, uh, the signs are pointing right to them right there. So if you have a disability and you were lucky enough to find the uh, elevators that I told you about, then you can come down here and use the bathroom as well. So. We're just going to walk around the food court, just show you guys all the uh, various types of overpriced food they have down here. And because it's just after lunchtime, it's probably going to be a little bit packed down here as well. I was going to do left to right, but we'll go right to left instead. What the heck? Oh no, I can do left to right. Here we go. Now, not that I use this, but obviously, as you can see, there are also tracks down here as well. I see the uh, shoe shine booth there, and it re immediately reminds me of Goodfellas. 
Now get your shine box. <laughs> I'm not sure if you've seen that one, but it's a great scene with uh, Joe Pesci. There's barely a scene in that film that isn't great for Joe Pesci. So you can see there are bathrooms at this end of the food court as well. Always keep that in mind guys, because you're in New York and you see a bathroom, use it. Because you don't never know when you're gonna see another one. I'll tell you one thing as well, it's really cool down here. Anyway, it's a somewhat shorter video today. I actually thought the food court was a little bit bigger, but no problem. I'll keep the uh, I'll keep the camera rolling until we uh, get outside the building here.
I just met with a man. Okay, that's what we'll do for today, guys. Please go ahead and subscribe if you like the video. Got plenty more videos coming up for you. Have to get out of the way there before I press the button. All right, that's it for now, guys. I'll uh, catch you tomorrow. That's exactly